Chickens, what's happening? What's shaking? What's going on? This is Andy coming to you again from here at Andy's World at Base, and today I'm going to play a little bit and uh, talk about my Ampeg bass rig. This is the PF50T tube head and two of the flip top cabinets. The top one has two tens in it, the bottom has one fifteen. 50 watt all tube, kind of a modern version of the the classic, um, you know, Ampeg um, flip top amps of uh, of yesteryear that were, you know, the most popular and widely used amps for a period of time. It's it's kind of a low wattage all tube amplifier, medium wattage all tube amplifier that has a very great um, classic tube sound. I personally have found that I can get the most useful sound for what I need, the, the loudest, punchiest, um, fattest, and tightest sound using a few very specific things. A genuine P bass with passive pickups, flat wound strings, and a pick. That's just me. I've had this amp for five years now. I've used it a lot, and it also sounds really good with upright. You know, my upright rig sounds good through this. But for electric bass, uh, P bass, passive, flat wound strings, and a pick. So let's put on a drum beat, and I'll try and groove along.
that's the best tone I can get out of it. I mean, the, the, the tone that I like the most. And I can get it, and I can get it quite loud. Um, trying to use like a active five string modern bass, Warwick or MTD or something along those lines doesn't really doesn't really get me too excited but this little recipe PF50T the two flip top caps vintage Fender Precision Bass passive pickups this one happens to have Nord Strand NP4A pickups in it flat wound strings these are the Golly Jazz flats, 45 to 105. The thing I like about these flats is they have tension, but they also have flex. 45 to 105 flats and a pick. I think that's the that's the sweet spot with this particular amp. Um, if that's kind of where you're at, what, what, what you're digging, you know. I'll play it with my fingers to show you. And that don't sound bad. It sounds killer, actually, but I like it with the pick. All right, friends, thanks for watching this video. Thanks for watching all the videos. Thank you to Ampeg. Thank you to Dino. Man, proud of you, Dino. Me and Dino have been doing good with our, our weight loss these last couple of years. He and I don't look anything like we used to look. So that's a real special thing that we share besides being bass players, being friends, loving Ampeg, and, and to a certain degree, um, you know, working together. So it's all good. All right, friends. Peace. See you next time.